Hello, this is Broyer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Farming Simulator 22 as we continue our Swiss chocolate run here. And I uh, got our trailer and tractor set up, although this is technically the wrong spot. We got to get over to the sugar area because that is actually what we're going to be selling next. Um, so we'll go ahead and zip on over there and then we'll fast forward to August and sell some sugar. Quite a bit of sugar available to sell, so hopefully we get, you know, a little bit of money back for this. All right, I just wanted to load up a bit just so we have, um, you know, decent amount available to us. Still quite a bit in there, to be fair, uh, but there's plenty of room for more to get stored. So we'll go ahead and just leave this as is. Let's jump out. We will fast forward and get ready for hopefully a decent price on our sugar. Got a lot to sell. It's going to take quite a few trips with this trader, the way it's set up. I do like this auto loader a lot better than the last one because I haven't had any problems with it. But it does load it quite a bit uh, smaller. Like there's, there's, there's less being loaded at a time. All right. So cheese is actually at a pretty good price at the moment as well. Speaking of cheese, we are completely out. So we will actually temporarily deactivate that. Um, and then let's check here for... Well, we'll check this cheese price first because why not? Uh, did I pass it? There it is. Um... High price is supposed to be October, so we're still a little ways away from that. Uh, so we'll expect that to go up a bit more. And then sugar. High price, we're expecting to be... Wait. Now I'm confused. I know this said... High price was in August. Before, or else I wouldn't have written it down, right? Like, did I... Now it says this is going to be a low price. Well... It is at a good price, at the, well, decent price at the moment. It's not terror. It's not like the highest price, but it's an okay price, and currently still going up. So hopefully we can still get a really good price for it. We shall see, I guess. Uh, if we have to sell it to the chocolatier, how do we do that? If the chocolatier is full, I don't think we can sell it to the chocolatier. Actually, I think we have to sell it to the supermarket. Um, how are our cows doing? Uh, slurry's getting a little bit full. Straw's okay. TMR's mostly okay. So yeah, we're, we're okay with the cows for the moment. Um, anything else we've got to do with our crops at the moment? I think the next thing we've got to do is... Let's see, what we got to harvest the sugar beets in... October. Although I think we did it a month later, didn't we? We'll check. Well, I mean, we're, we're, we're still a little ways away. So we're not going to have to sell it right away. And then cheese is actually coming up in October as well. So... We expect that to go a bit more. So I guess really the only thing to do is to fast forward and see if we can get a good price for um, the sugar. Specifically at the uh, supermarket. It's not really going up right now. Or if it is, it's going up extremely slowly. I don't think we're going to get close to that 530 range, unfortunately. Yeah, I do not see that happening at all. I'm going to go ahead and start driving over there. Yeah, it's not budging.
I mean, we're getting like a dollar here and there, maybe. We'll go a little bit further, but if we get a little bit too close to the nighttime, I might go ahead and just call it, well, 518 now. Well, never mind. Maybe if it's going to keep going, we'll we'll let it go. 524. All right, all right. Keep going. I mean, it's basically caught up with the chocolatier at this point, which is good. Guess we'll let it keep going then. I guess if it, I mean, we can drive at night. We got lights. It's pretty much all we had to do today anyway. Alright, that's done. Okay, let's go start selling as much as we can. I mean, it's not a lot of money per trip, but we'll be able to make quite a few trips here. Definitely will get us out of the hole here. Have to invest in a bigger trailer at some point if we're going to keep selling sugar like this. I mean, the other uh, products aren't that bad. It's like a couple trips, maybe. But the sugar is obviously a much larger amount. Well, much smaller packaging, maybe, is the better way to put it. Excuse you. Let's see. I mean, how much we're we gonna get from all this? That's two trips of about what six, about almost seven thousand dollars. Um, how many more trips do we got over here? We've got four here, and then we've got. I think we've got at least four, or at least a couple more in here, right? Oh, we've got several there actually. So. Uh, we're going to get some good money here. It's going to take a while, but we're going to have some good money.
Lots and lots of sugar. Still got sugar sitting on the uh, the point over at the chocolatier as well. So we got plenty of sugar for our chocolate right now. Trying to figure out what this thing was on the end here. Bollinger? Bollinger Sport? It's like skiing and stuff. Alright, cool. We just don't have any very large money makers on this this run. I mean, the cheese has been okay. The chocolate's going to be all right, you know. But they're still both kind of relatively small money makers. Nothing like clothing, that's for sure. There's cows sell for about as much as anything. Six cows at their max price is what, $9,000? So, I mean, that's not bad. For a trailer load. Now, we can't sell those quite as often as some of this other stuff. I mean, I don't know. I don't know that we're going to be selling. Well, if we get into a flow of things, I, I guess we probably could sell six to twelve cows every year actually may maybe more than that actually i come think come to think of it Still got what? Five more trips? Six more trips. Because we got the six sitting out there and then 30,000 still inside the factory right now. All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead for the rest of these trips and we'll be back momentarily. All right, we're back. We just picked up the last load here. Uh, I do need to switch this over to um, start distributing to the chocolate factory. It's not quite full at the moment. I did finish up. Uh, there was some sitting on the entry point there that hadn't quite gotten loaded in. I, I got that loaded in properly now. Uh, but we'll go ahead and just turn, flip this over to um, distributing now. 
And uh, we got plenty of sugar beets there to fill up the chocolate. And we should be okay to sell this last little bit. Pretty good chunk of money so far. Um, yeah. Can't complain too much about... Uh, I mean, the only thing, the only complaint I would have, really, is uh, the fact that it took me quite a few trips here. Um, we definitely need to get a better trailer that can uh, cut the trips down quite a bit. All right, there we go. All said and done. Uh, $35,227 in actual sold products plus another $4,800 from the bonus. So, like, l almost exactly $40,000. $40, Just a little bit over $40,000, but pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, we'll go ahead and repay a bunch of loan for now. And anything else we need to knock out real quick? I don't think so. We'll be doing cheese here shortly. We already talked about that. Cheese will come up here in um, October. So two more months on the cheese. And then um, the harvesting of the sugar beets, I think will be November. I think, didn't we do April? I can't, I suddenly can't remember, but I think we did April. Um, so I think it'll be November on the sugar beets. Either way, even if it was October, we'll be able to sell the cheese before we have to harvest the sugar beets, which means we'll have plenty of money to get the good uh, harvesters, which we're really going to need for the size of fields that we have. The the tractor harvester, the one that attaches to our little tractor here, is just too... It's not that it's even not too narrow. I mean, it, they're, they're all not very wide at all. Like, that, that's just the way sugar beets are. It's just that you have to go empty it so frequently because it's such a small hopper on it. Um, definitely, definitely want to improve that as much as we can. So I guess we can drop this off at, I guess, the cheese place? And, um, because that'll be the next thing we sell here in two, two more months. Okay, quite a bit of cheese to sell. So that will be really, really good for us to, uh, to get some more money from. All right. Well, that's that. I don't think we have to do anything with the cows today. You guys are good. You guys are, I mean, almost full and slurry, like we said before, but should be good on the TMR. So I think we can fast forward one more month and then we'll have to immediately deal with cows. We'll just get back over to the farm and then we'll take it from there. All right, there we go. That's not what I wanted. Well, there we go. Uh, let's go ahead and fast forward to the next month. Cheese is at a pretty good price right now. We'll double check real quick just to make sure. Oh, wow. That changed again, didn't it? Wasn't it like up, up, and up to go, leading up to October? Now it's up, down, and up. Just can't make up its mind, but it's still October, so we will hold off. What about the sugar? Just out of curiosity, did it go anything higher than? It's basically more or less the same price, but now the same. The highest price is September, which is annoying, but not much we can do about that. Um, speaking of sugar, did we fill up the chocolate? Almost filled it up. Got a little bit more sugar beets left, not a ton, but we should have enough to fill that thing up. Uh, cows are looking pretty 
low on food. And we do have some cows that are about to reproduce. Yes, 90%. Right there. Oh, you know what? I think I had these three cows here that were ready to reproduce as well. Oh, no, no. Those are zero months. Was it these then? And I think they did reproduce because that's them right there. Okay, so no, we're good on those three. We got four more that are about to reproduce as well. I need to start figuring out how to split this up into sixes, you know, sets of six. Just because that's what our trailer holds, right? Well, let's take care of the cow's food first, and then we'll uh, figure out how we're going to start splitting them up a bit more better. A little dark. I guess I can have a little bit of light here. We're just in the shadow of, I guess, the mountains right now or the clouds. Do we need uh, straw as well? No, we're actually okay on straw, surprisingly. Get that dropped in there. We'll get us some hay. So we got a lot of silage left in here. Yes. I have to figure out another way to uh, store some of this stuff. 
guess we're gonna need just a, we need more space so that we can put another well i guess we have a little bit of space by the sugar mill but we need to be able to put more uh like another hay loft as well as uh, another silage thing down somewhere All right, that is done. All right, cows are fed. Uh, like I said, they have straw. They've got hay over here. Uh, I think next episode we'll figure out what cows we're going to sell, and then we'll take care of that. But I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you, and I hope you join me again next time. Thank you, and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout-out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.